Thank you. I'd like to ask you about the uh, BLM's revised hydraulic fracturing rule today. You announced extending the comment period another 60 days. Um, I understand the oil and gas producers will be able to obtain a, a variance from, from BLM's uh, rules in states which have their own hydraulic fracturing rules that, quote, meet or exceed the BML, uh, BLM's rule. I mean, that's how it's written. Correct. Uh, but BLM may, it's, it says also that the BLM may rescind this variance or modify the conditions of approval at, at any time. So this is hardly the certainty that, that you acknowledge during your confirmation process uh, is so important for the private sector. You had said they need certainty. Uh, it's unclear to me why BLM is adding federal regulations on top of state regulations. Well, you know, Wyoming adopted hydraulic fracturing regulations about three years ago. Uh, since then, uh, nearly all states who have meaningful uh, oil and gas production have adopted or are in the process of adopting their own hydraulic fracturing rules. Uh, many states, such as Wyoming, already apply their rules to federal lands uh, within their borders. So in this respect, BLM's rule is a solution, it seems to me, looking for a problem. So do you believe that states which are currently regulating hydraulic fracturing aren't doing a sufficient job? And if so, which states do you have in mind? Well, Senator, I, I, I want to say that uh, it's highly variable between states. The state of Wyoming is sophisticated in its uh, oversight of hydraulic fracturing. We uh, applaud that. You understand the resources within the state, and uh, I think that it's, it's a good example of, uh, of a state that's doing an effective job. Our role is to provide minimum acceptable standards on public lands. That is our oversight on behalf of the American people, and that's what we're doing. The reason for the comment period, um, the 30 days initially and now the extension of 60 days, is to provide uh, uh, an opportunity for people to comment on those rules to determine if it's problematic for them. And so we will be listening to those comments and reacting as well, appropriate. I, I appreciate it, because the variance process leads to uncertainty. It doesn't give the kind of certainty that you talked about in, the, in, in your confirmation, so I appreciate that.